Greetings, foolish mortals. Um, it's been a weird week. I've been sick most of the week, so that's why I've kind of missed uh, the uh, Lego streams. But I'm feeling much better now, so probably start those up again on Monday in new time, 10 a.m. But first, I wanted to go over the what I'm calling the last great Target haul. Um, I've made some decisions about life and about my collection, and um, I am no longer going to be purchasing most stuff. Um, there's no need in collecting things just to disseminate them. Um, so this is probably the last big Target clearance haul um, I ever do. I may still pick up some Star Wars figures here and there. It's hard not to. It's I'm hardwired, and I will collect all the Indiana Jones that I've already pre-ordered. But um, this is the last big haul like you guys normally see me do. So let's go ahead and get uh, the cameras flipped around, and I'll show you what I got over the past week or so. So... The whole table is covered with stuff, as usual. So I'm going to go ahead and start showing you things and putting them in a container, clearing stuff as we go. Um, now, all of this except a couple pieces I got on their clearance sale. And it's still going, and they still got some stuff here and there, but really at the moment all the action figures and stuff are all sold out. So let's just start in front of me. I got a new Friends Lego set. I don't collect friends, but it was $5, um, and I can use the recycling truck. I hate the figures, but I can always use uh, more Legos because, you know, when don't I? Uh, speaking of that, I picked up three of these. This is a Cyber Drone, and you can also make this little other craft and a robot. I got three of them because they were $4 a piece, and if I have three of them, I can make all three vehicles. So, I got those for that reason. I also picked up a complete set, except for Indiana Jones, of the Adventure Series figures. So, here's Sala. And uh, Ceremonial Belloc. I still wish they do a normal Belloc. I know they've got that two-pack coming, though. Tote. Azim from Last Crusade. And Ma Marion Ravenwood. I also got Indy and his tux from Temple of Doom, but I've already put that in a box going to a friend in Kansas who collects. Here are the uh, retro figures. It's Temple of Doom, Indy. And short round. Short round was still three bucks more than all the rest of them. Uh, German mechanic. Belloc. Belouch. Tote. And of course, Marion. I picked up this Hulk Hogan because I do collect Hogan's and um, Undertaker's. I actually collect a lot of WWE legends. I got this Geo Sturmbaga. I guess that's how you pronounce it. I, I'm not sure. Type of a pterodon. I got this Friends set because it was uh, actually it was nine ninety nine. Not a bad set. Again, I got it mostly for the buildings. I don't I don't care for those Friends figures. I picked up um, Cyclops for twelve bucks, and same with Emma Frost. So I got those for 12. Um, let's do more wrestling here. Got the Ultimate Razor Ramon. It's hard to get the shadow in there. 
Uh, but they were 16. And I do have a lot of the ultimates. I buy them when they go on clearance. And I got the ultimate, ultimate warrior. Great figure. Now this little guy, this is a crimson bat. And he was marked $21, but when I scanned him, he came up $14. So I picked it up. I don't have very many G.I. Joes. And then the same with this dude. I do not have any uh, a Falcon, but for $12, um, he'll sit in the collection and, you know, he'll be sit like that or sit with his number out, one or the other. Um, to go with my Pterodon... Got this guy from the Hammond collection. Unfortunately, he was the only one left and he got smooshed, but that's all right. He's clearance. Um, also from Jurassic Park, these little guys were like five bucks. I actually I think they were like three bucks. And they, they have a little rawr. Rawr, rawr. Velociraptor. And then uh, they had some Guardians of the Galaxy, the Epic Hero Series. So I got Star-Lord and Groot and Drax and Mantis. So I don't know if they did them all, but if they did, I'm still missing three. Now, this wasn't on clearance, but I had to get it. It's a glow-in-the-dark Herman Munster from Super 7, and it's based on the old Rimco monsters. I, I You know me and Super 7. But there's also an, a uh, Mars Attacks one like this that I really want to get. More Jurassic Park. Had this cool kitchen encounter. Comes with the kids and a Velociraptor. It was nine bucks. Not a bad price for, you know, a couple figures I don't have. Then the Flash stuff all started going clearance. And this is the uh, Batwing, Flash, and, and Batmo, uh, Batman. It was 12 bucks, so, you know, I don't don't know the movie, but because uh, uh, it comes out this week on uh, HBO Max, and then I'll watch it. Let's see, these here. Okay. Hang on a sec. I'll move some of the stuff out of my way so I can get to the other stuff. Um, well, shoot. This is not going to fit properly. There we go. So Indy and all the Lego go together. Okay. Then I picked up a couple new puzzles because I've been buying these as I see them. This is the villainous puzzle for Melissifant. And then the puzzle for Gaston. I like these villainous puzzles. I have a whole bunch of them. I haven't put any of them together yet. Don't know if I ever will. We'll have to see. Then lastly, what I got was a whole bunch of Masters of the Universe figures for $10 each. So I got Scare Glow. Shadow Weaver from Princess of Power. From New Eternia, Banny Faces, and uh, from Sunman, Pighead. So I, I don't buy a lot of these Masters of the Universe, but for 10 bucks a piece, I will. Um, I buy a lot of clearance I don't necessarily like just to have it. Um, so that's really about it. Um, I picked up a few things for other people. And then um, I did pick up a new 
new box of these Obi-Wan cards um, that I'll add to the others. I'm nowhere near a set, but I'm trying. So that was it for this, guys. Um, I got a few more coming out. I uh, got some cool stuff from Haunted Mansion, some Funko. Uh, hit a clearance sale over at GameStop. So a few new videos coming up. And until next time, catch you guys on the flip side.